most welcome to Sandarya School e-learning channel. Dear children, the entire nation is living in social distancing due to the global problem and disaster like coronavirus, COVID-19. There is a hope and a complete confidence that all your family and you will be healthy. My best wishes to all of you follow as per the norms of the government. In this time period, we are starting our course for e-learning. Let us discuss social science subject of class 4. The book that you will read throughout the season 2020-2021 is titled as Success with Social Science. The name of this book is Ragni Sharma and the book is published by Spirit Publishing House. There are 17 chapters in this book. The first chapter is Natural Features of India. So let's begin the chapter. The country we live in is called India. It is the seventh biggest country of the world in terms of area. It is also the second largest country in the terms of population. Now let us discuss about the location. The mainland India is bounded by the Indian Ocean on the south, the Arabian Sea on the west and the Bay of Bengal on the east. It is located in the south of Asia continent. India is bordered by Pakistan to the west, China, Nepal and Bhutan to the north and Bangladesh and Myanmar to the east. Sri Lanka and Maldives lie to the south. These are India's neighboring countries. In shape, India is broad in the middle. It narrows down towards the south forming a triangular peninsula. India has area of about 32.87 lakh square kilometer. Its length from north to south is about 3,214 km and its width from east to west is 2,992 km. The southernmost tip of the mainland of India is at Kanyakumari. The southernmost tip of the country is India. Indra Point in Nicobar Islands. The Tropic of Cancer passes through the middle of the country. Now let us discuss about the neighboring countries. A country, India, is a friendly country and maintains good relations with all her neighbors. On the west, India is flanked by Pakistan and Afghanistan. On her east is Bangladesh and Myanmar. China is to the northeast of India. Nepal and Bhutan are in the north and Sri Lanka is India's neighbor in south. A narrow 20 km wide channel of sea called Park Strait and the Gulf of Mannar separate India from Sri Lanka. Now I would like to share some points with you. First, we live in India. Second, India's length from north to south is about 3,240 km. Third, India is a republic and it is a called the unions of state. Fourth, on her east is Bangladesh and Myanmar. Fourth, the country is divided into 29 states and 7 union territories. Sixth, the earth rotates on its axis and revolves around the sun. Now let's do some exercise. Take the correct options. Your first question is, on the basis of physical features, 
India can be divided into physical divisions. Your options are first, one, second, five, third, eight. So the correct answer is five. So now the second question is China is to the dash of India. Your options are first, northwest, second, southeast, third, northeast. So the correct option is northeast. Now your third question is India has dash states. Your options are first 27, second 26, third 29. So the correct option is 29. Your fourth question is India has an area of about. Your options are 42.87 lakh square kilometer second. 32.23 lakh square kilometer third 32.87 lakh square kilometer so your correct answer is 32.87 lakh square kilometer so here are some fill in the blanks type of questions the options are given so let us solve it the first question is India is flanked by Pakistan and so the correct answer is China. So your second question is we all live in test. Your correct answer is India. Now the third question is its length from north to dash is about dash kilometer. So the correct answer is its length from north to south is about 3214 kilometer. So, your fourth question is Rajasthan is the dash state of India. The correct answer is largest. So, your chapter is over. Thank you for watching our video. Please press the bell icon.